So the other day I took apart the five inch dredge on the other side and uh, cleaned out the old riffles that still had some sand in it and the side notches that I use for storage and got all the rust off of the mat. Then I ran the dirt through the cleanup sluice, whatever, still stuff from last time. And yeah, we got rain. Um, but I just, this is dirt from over a year ago. It's still sitting in there. You can see all the, all the pyrite that's still in there. I mean, this stuff has been rusted over because it's <coughs> all the rust in the box from the old riffles that I'm going to be redoing. But the hematite, the pyrite. So I'm going to just see if I can... Some wood, a little bit of gold. <laughs> Which is shocking, it sat in the box for two years. Let me turn this around. <clears throat> yeah, I don't mind me, I look like shit, but... Guess it quick. And there's about three, four pieces of lead. Get this bigger stuff away. Get that out of there. So the way this five-inch box is set up, there's dog hair. Um, I have about four inches on both sides, about eight inches long. That's a dead zone. It actually ends up flaring out part of the flare um, that goes to the box that makes it two feet wide from the stock five inch crash box that I had rebuilt. So, um, show you guys this, see if we can camera zoom in there there we go look at that this nice cloudy sky <laughs> is actually perfect lighting right now you can see those fines that are sitting right there and a couple little chunky pieces there so for it being at least a year and a half old and all the rain in the winter there's still was gold sitting in there so anyways it's pretty cool still see it so sweet